One out of four human beings with their hands on bars, shackled, in the world are locked up here in the land of the free. Khalif Browder was walking home from a party when he was stopped by police. Then they said, we're going to take you to the precinct, and most likely we're going to let you go home. And then I never went home. 13th Amendment to the Constitution makes it unconstitutional for someone to be held as a slave. There are exceptions, including criminals. The loophole was immediately exploited. What you got after that was a rapid transition to a mythology of black criminality. Some people got the real problem. Animals, beasts that needed to be controlled. You better believe it. I'm only human. It became virtually impossible for a politician to run and appear soft on crime. The kinds of kids that are called super predators. Millions of dollars will be allocated for prison and jail facilities. Three strikes and you are out. It was an enormous burden on the black community, but it also violated a sense of core fairness. Some people got the real the states were required to keep these prisons filled, even if nobody was committing a crime. It's so difficult to talk about mass incarceration because it has become heavily monetized. I'm only human. The focus is on taking people from prison, putting them in community corrections, parole and probation. How much progress is it really if now there's a private company making money off the GPS monitor? now have more African Americans under criminal supervision than all the slaves back in the 1850s. We are the products of the history that our ancestors chose. Products of that set of choices that we have to understand in order to escape from it. We should go.